Project Search is new to Bishop Grady Villas. We coach them on job skills and life skills. The first one is Emily, and um, she's very soft-spoken, very sweet. What she does is she assembles kits for the phlebotomist. So she has a chart that shows her every step of the way. I can see already her sense of accomplishment and pride in what she does. She works um, also in the same facility as Philip. I am a Philip a Anderson and I'm a, a project search student. It was very complicated work, you know, counting test tubes, identifying colors, using checklists. All of those things are pretty rigorous tasks. Believe it or not, he's getting his work done early because he's so efficient. So he's got enormous potential. Chantel is like an old soul. She's um, mature and responsible. Chantel um, can sit and follow a project um, with a lot of detail from start to finish completely independently. I get to deliver supplies to the floors and that's my favorite thing to do because it makes me feel like I'm actually doing something important. My name is Lauren. I do blankets, pillows, I check the bathrooms too, and I stop too. All the blankets are full. They're advocating for themselves, they're asking for help, they're negotiating their way around the, the hospital. All of those things are amazing skills that are already starting to blossom. Best part about engineering is we, we fix stuff. Project Search, they help you get a job of what, of what your department is about. I believe they can help students achieve more of their goal. Having the opportunity to be in Project Search provides for them an incredible future. Last year I worked at Gaylord Palms in Kissimmee and it was interesting to see how the placements were career placements. I'm Dominic Miller and I work at a banquet setup. I'm a big fan to fancying things out. What excites me really is just get, keep myself busy and letting time be aside. It does feel uh, really amazing. I mean, more than amazing. I'm, I love working. I do each work around cleaning out the baseboards and the rugs. My favorite part about going to work is seeing everybody. When I go around, I say to them, hello, good morning, good afternoon. I've always felt that my mission in life um, is to help others live to their maximum potential. When I read the mission statement of Bishop Grady Villas, it was almost exactly that. We help those that have barriers to overcome them, and that most definitely is God's work. I have a lot of energy. I'm not a person who sits all day. I'm a person who wants to get up and work, you know. They taught me how to fix toilets, plumbing, electrical uh, wiring, how to work the AC, and how to clean the coils of the AC. I always notice about Nick that he was very computer oriented. And I said, well, he can probably teach me something while I'll teach him something else too. So little by little, he, we kept doing things together until I got to a point that I saw that he can do it on his own. It's just myself and four children. I couldn't find a full-time position because I needed to be there for my children, especially Nicholas with special needs. Now, thanks to Bishop Grady, I have a full-time position. My son has a full-time position. Thank you for the experience. Thank you for the training. Thank you for um, helping me landing this job, because without this program, I would have, you know, s stood at home. We're independent, and this for us is a relief. And for me, <laughs> it's a blessing. <laughs>